Hi dear students, in this video we are going to study about highest common factor with the other name greatest common factor, greatest common factor and least common multiple. I'm especially using desired because I'm going to use the capital letters to abbreviate this expression GCF and LCM it's going to be. So we are going to study about greatest common factor and least common multiple in this video okay what about uh, the definitions here the first definition we are going to find the multiples what is multiples we know what is factor because multiple uh, of a tree if we get uh, if, if you want to find the multiple of a number you are going to multiply the number one by one with the counting numbers let's say if we are looking for the multiple of three multiples of three Firstly, uh, we are going to multiply by 1, 3 times 1 is equal to 3, 3 times 2 is equal to 6, 3 times 4, 3 is equal to 9. So these are the multiples of uh, 3. Also, you can say like this, all these are divisible by 3 in order to divisible by 3. The next number it's going to be 12, 3 times uh, that's then it's going to be 15, then it's going to be 18, then 21 then 24, then 27, then 30, 33, 37, uh, 36. Here it's going to be, by some reason I'm writing this one, 36, then it's going to be equal to 39, then it's going to be equal to 42, then it's going to be 45, then it's going to continue like this. Okay, so if we are talking about the multiples of 5, multiples of 5, of 5 sorry multiples of 5 here it's going to be you're going to start with 5 again the next number 5 plus 5 or 5 times 2 it's equal to 10 then 5 times 3 15 you can find like this 15 20 25 30 35 40 45 and you can continue like this why I stop at 45 because I want to show the common uh, multiples so here multiples of three these are multiples of five these are what are the common what are the common multiples of of three and five what are the common multiples of three and five here as you see the 15 is the first one here 15 and then 30 then 30 then 45 these are the common multiples we can find more but I'm going to write with 15 then 30 then 45 is you see the difference between them uh, 15 so 15 30 15 plus 15 45 the next one probably it's going to 60 but this is not important now for us okay so these are the common multiples of 3 and 5 and here the uh, definition is coming what is the LCM least common multiple of 3 and 5 is sorry LCM of 3 and 5 is 15 these are all multiples of 5 common multiples of 3 and 5 sorry these are all common multiples of 3 and 5 but the least one is 15 okay now the second definition is coming what is what is the common factor of the uh, 60 and 72 let's say what uh, highest common factor now let's write all the factors of factors of all the factors of 60 we know that uh, number divisible by always itself that's why the greatest com and the greatest factor is 60 if you divide by 2 it will be 30 if you divide by 3 it will be uh, 20 if you divide by 4 it will be 15 if you divide by 5 it will be 12 if you divide by 6 it will be 10 if you divide by 
here. And the next one, it will be maybe uh, we divide by uh, here by five, here divide by six. Now I do, I'm going to divide by seven, no, eight, no, uh, nine, no, then ten, it's going to be six. Then uh, you're going to divide by 12, it's going to be five. You're going to divide by all the, all these are, it's going to come here. 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. These are all the factors of 60. Let's continue with the uh, factors of factors of 72. The factors of 72 are 72 itself. If you divide by 2, it's going to be equal to 36. If you divide by 3, it's going to be equal to 24. If you divide by 4, it's going to be equal to 18. If you divide by 5, no, it is not divisible by 5. If you divide by 6, it's going to be equal to 12. If you divide by 7, no, it is not divisible. If you divide by 8, it's going to be 9. If you divide by now 9, it's coming. After this part, we are going to continue to this one side. Uh, and if you divide by uh, 9, it's equal to 8. If you divide by 12, it's going to be equal to 6. If you divide by 18, it's going to be equal to uh, 4. If you divide by uh, 24, it's going to be equal to 3. If you divide by 36, it's going to be equal to 2. If you divide by 72, it's going to be equal to 1. So these are the factors of 72. And now we are going to find the least, we are going to find the common factors. These, which are the common factors? Common factors. The common factors here, as you see in table here, 12, it seems, the common factor. 6 is the, let's circle them like the previous. 12 is the common factor here. 6 is the common factor here also. And here, uh, 4, it's, yes, it's the common factor. 3, 2, 1, these are all common factors here. Uh, we can write as a common factor. These are also, these are common factors. So, common factors, let me write here 12, 6, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Okay, the greatest common factor, greatest common factor of 60 and 72, it's going to be equal to because these are the common factors and the greatest one is 12 and we are going to learn how to make these operations like this now I'm going to show one simple method to find the greatest common factor or least common multiple uh, with some easy ways firstly I'm going to show how to find the greatest common factor firstly I'm going to write 60 and 70 like I'm finding the prime factors of them and I'm going to try to divide both of the number by using the prime numbers if you remember the prime numbers 2, 3, 5, 7 these are going to be uh, and the smallest prime number is 2 and I'm going to uh, divide by 2 both of them and 2 is dividing both of them 60 it becomes 30 72 the next number is 72 I'm sorry 72 it's going to be equal to 72 it's going to be equal to 36 so 2 still dividing both of them 2 times 2 it's equal to pardon, uh, 36, 30 divided by 2, it's equal to 15, and 2 divides 36 here, also it's going to be equal to 18. Uh, here, this number is not divisible, but still there is a number divisible, so we have to continue with 2. Uh, till the time to complete the uh, 2, the next number it's going to be 3, so it's divisible, still divisible by 2, this is going to repeat because this is not divisible, and this is going to be equal to 9. So 2 divides to, uh, two divides 18, the result is 9, but now 
3 is going to divide because 2 is not dividing 15 or 9. 3 divides both of them, it's going to be equal to 5. This is going to be equal to 3. And here, 3 divides 3, then uh, it's going to be equal to 1. And this is going to repeat 5. And this is the last part. This is going to be 5. And this is not, we are not going to continue with this side. And the answer here, it's going to be equal to 1. And here, it's equal to 1. So these are the common factors of, uh, actually, these are the factors. And the common factors, I'm going to circle the common factors, which divides both of them. Here, this, to divide both of the numbers, so it becomes 30 and 36, that's why I circle. And this divided also both of them. And here, these are, uh, the third one is this one. These are the, these are the common factors. Common factors. And greatest common factor, factor is 2 times 2 times 3, which is equal to 12, it's going to be. So the common factor is 2, time, uh, two, two and 3. The greatest factor, common factor is the product of these common factors, which is equal to 2 times 2 times 3. And we already found before the same number. OK, what about the least common multiple? The multiples of 60 and 72, I'm not going to write. And least common multiple in the previous page, in this page, if you remember, we found here how to find the multiples. but uh, we are going to find like this LCM of the 60 and 72 it's going to be equal to LCM of 60 and 72 it's going to be 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 times 3 times 5 so all the factors what are written here this is going to be least common multiple and the result it's going to be equal to 2 times 2 times Two, it's equal to 8 times 9 it's going to be then it's going to be equal to 5 8 times 5 it is 40 then times 9 it's going to be equal to 360 so the answer least common multiple 60 and 72 is 360 greatest common factor of 60 and 72 it's going to be equal to 12.